Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us today. We have some breaking news concerning the Opposition Workers' Party, WP, and a video that has been circulating on social media. In this 15-second clip, there appears to be an inappropriate exchange between senior party members Leon Pereira and Nicole Sayer, both of whom are married and hold prominent positions within the WP. Leon Pereira, a member of parliament for Aljuniad, is seen in the video dining with Nicole Sayer, who was a candidate in the 2020 general election. In the footage, Mr. Pereira is shown holding and stroking Ms. Sayer's hands. It is important to note that both individuals are part of the WP's Central Executive Committee, with Mr. Pereira leading the media team and Ms. Sayer serving as the Youth Wing President. In response to the video, the Workers' Party has issued a statement acknowledging its existence and stating that they are currently looking into the matter. They have expressed their intention to comment once they have gathered all the relevant facts. The party also emphasized that they expect all their members to take full ownership and accountability for their behavior. Let's take a closer look at the individuals involved. Leon Pereira, who will be turning 53 this year, first gained prominence in Singapore's political landscape during the 2015 general election when he ran as a candidate for East Coast. He later became a non-constituency member of parliament before joining the WP's successful slate for the Aljuniad constituency in the 2020 elections. Prior to his political career, Mr. Pereira worked as a civil servant and later co-founded and served as the chief executive officer of a business research and consulting agency. According to a 2015 WP biography, archived online, Mr. Pereira, is reported to have a wife named Carol and two children, a daughter, and a son. Nicole Sayo, on the other hand, joined the Workers' Party in 2015 after being associated with the Reform Party and the National Solidarity Party. She gained online fame as the youngest female candidate during the 2011 general election and later took a hiatus before returning as a WP candidate for East Coast in the 2020 polls. Ms. Sayer and her husband Brian welcomed their second daughter in April of last year. In 2020, she was reported to be working at a multinational marketing firm. Now, it is important to remember that at this stage, we do not have all the details surrounding the video or the context in which it was recorded. As such, it is crucial to await the results of the Workers' Party's internal investigation to understand the full circumstances and implications of the incident. We encourage you, our viewers, to share your thoughts on this matter in the comments section below. Do you think this incident will have an impact on the reputation of the Workers' Party? How should political parties handle such situations involving their members? We look forward to hearing your perspectives and engaging in a constructive discussion. Before we conclude, we kindly request you to like this video share it with others who may be interested, and subscribe to our channel for more updates on this and other important news stories. Your support is greatly appreciated. Thank you for joining us, and we'll keep you informed as more information becomes available.